Yo, what's going on guys? It's um, it's Saturday. I'm in Jacksonville, Florida. It's the 21st. Uh, I was supposed to go down to Miami. Yo, what's going on guys? It's um, it's Saturday. I'm in Jacksonville, Florida. It's the 21st. Uh, I was supposed to go down to Miami today, but I ended up having to cancel. Um, just because I, I didn't have a place to stay actually um, but it's all good you know I was just trying to help out a friend uh, with a company and and he's got it covered so no worries so instead I'm taking initiative your boy shaved he looks he looks a little more well groomed um, like normal <laughs> I was letting this little thing grow for a little bit I don't know sometimes you got to play with it you know um, but I went ahead and shaved cleaned up a little bit made a phone call earlier I'm actually heading to the poker room now not to play but I'm actually stalking the boss kinda I'm trying to I've been trying to get a hold of the poker manager because I just finished school as you know um, and I'm trying to get a job so the best case scenario the best um, scenario would be me staying in Jacksonville and working here as a dealer at one of these poker rooms at best bet that's that's the best case scenario um, Worst case is, you know, I, I go through with my audition next week and I get hired to uh, Daytona and I either commute back and forth to Daytona depending on my shift schedule or I just move to Daytona for a year or so. Um, so you know what I'm going to do? <clears throat> People, let me just interject real quick. People, let me let this this uh, ambulance go through messing up, my, messing up my stuff right here. I know. I know other people are in need right now, but you know, I was on a roll. I was hot just now. It's hot. Hot. <laughs> but what I was trying to say, shit, what was I saying? Shut up. Um, yeah. So people don't become great on accident. Um, people become famous on accident, but there's a huge divide and a huge difference between being great and being famous. Now, um, now check this out. People do not become great. On accident and what I mean by that is if I want to become a dealer at a certain place in a certain position in a certain poker room or a casino then I gotta go for it I can't sit back and and think that a job is just gonna fall on my lap or that I'm even just gonna be able to work at Daytona because it's not guaranteed I still gotta pass my audition I practiced this morning actually I feel really confident with all the games um, dealing them without um, showing too much delay or too much thinking but what I'm actually trying to accomplish is I'm gonna go up to the poker manager I know there's a big tournament going on right now I wish I was playing in it damn it but um I'm gonna tr attempt to find the poker manager and steal him away for two minutes and just lay it all on the line lay it out there say hey sir if you have any if you have an opening I'd love to audition for you this week I just finished dealer school I already have my gaming license I have all days and nights available I have plenty of flexibility in my schedule I work overnights I can start immediately I'm very efficient blah 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 I learned very fast I learned how to deal all these games in just about three weeks etc etc and I know five or six dealers here currently and I know a couple of uh, pit bosses currently um, they'll vouch for me etc I'm gonna lay it all on the line in two minutes the same way I just gave it to you so and I'm already dressed. This is the, the actual audition attire for a dealer. It's white dress shirt, black dress pants. So I'm all ready to go. If he says something like, well, shit, they're on break. We got some cards right here. I got 10 minutes. Show me what you can do. Then you know what? I'm about to do that thing. I'm throwing it down. Bop, 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 bop. That's my dealing hand. That's not me flicking my, my poker manager. I'm just dealing. That's me dealing. So yeah, man, so I'm prepared for anything and everything. If he says, you know what, I'm going to throw you in a live game right now, deal it, and you got a job, I'll say, guess what, let's do the damn thing. Ha <laughs> ha, tap in, baby. But um, wish me luck. You never know what can happen, but I have more excitement about the opportunity of success than I do of the fear of failure. I already know that the odds are stacked against me, more so than... More times than not, he's gonna say, you know what, we don't have opportunity right now, but if you check back with us in a few months and um, we may be able to get you a job or get you an audition. Cool, that's already that's already here. We already have that in the front of our mind that he may say that, but guess what? He could also say, you know what, next week, why don't you come through? We got a 15 minute window, see, we'll see what you can do. Um, show up at this time, 
blah 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 and if, if it works out then we'll put you through the hiring process and we'll get you hired and put you on some shifts you know what I mean even if it's stacked 75 25 70 30 the cool thing is that 30% hits 100% of the time 70% of the time you know what I mean <laughs> I don't even know what that shit was just now so I just said some stuff and it, it made sense in my head but then I said it and it didn't make that much sense but it's all good I'm happy it's Saturday man I'm driving around we're gonna try and get some cool shots today um, I'm just I'm, I'm really just ready to get a job man I put in the work it's time to execute time to show my desire and we're gonna make this thing happy I know people that have been dealing for 20 30 years they've been dealing they have a full family they take two three va big vacations each year they go to Hawaii go to Europe they get paid time off full benefits as a dealer they make I, some years they make six figures sitting down dealing sitting down dealing I'm talking about they're around poker all day long sitting down dealing benefits 401k family house car vacation insurance dental vision that sounds like some shit that i can get into all right y'all good luck let's do this ha! Yo, what's up guys? So today was a bust, man. No love. Um, the dude was not even there who's the director of the poker rooms, um, both Orange Park and Jacksonville or Monument, however you want to say it. But um, that's okay because your boy is not giving up. You cannot stop a man's purpose. And my purpose right now is to become a poker dealer. Yes, sir. So basically what I did was I looked up all the emails to the director to the poker managers the shift managers the shift supervisors and I sent out an email you're damn right I hunted them bitches down and I sent an email I'm about to get a job and guess what it's all good it might not the perfect situation remember I said the perfect situation would be me staying in Jacksonville so I don't have to move right away don't have to acquire new rent um, get my stuff out of storage and uh, you know those kind of bills and things perfect situation would be staying right here in Jack's and working full-time here and then moving away but you know what sometimes it's not always perfect and I have an audition waiting for me next week in Daytona so I'm gonna go with whichever one comes first and I'm gonna ride it out because that's what G's do baby that's right and real quick I want to give a shout out to my girl Noel um, she's one of my she's become one of my really really close friends a uh, really strong supporter um, I don't put a whole lot of people on blast, but um, I want to say I really appreciate your support with everything I've done. Um, thank you for this amazing gift as far as my um, my poker setup. You guys saw the beautiful deck of cards. Um, that's not your average bicycle pack that you get from the gas station. So um, thank you for your support. Um, I really do appreciate it, and I'm definitely going to be doing this not only for myself, but for you and all my other supporters 
those of you guys that want me to be successful in everything that I do. Um, I, I have very few friends that are like that. And I want to give a shout out to my girl Erica from uh, Florence, Oregon. <coughs> she was also, also my uh, graphic designer for Who Can Rock the Crowd. And um, she's another person that I really want to give a big shout out to because she is um, a supporter of everything that I do. And um, that electric boiler has come in handy since I was sick. I had I was making tea for everybody. So shout out to you guys, uh, Noel, who's become a really close friend of mine, and Erica, who's also a really close friend of mine. Thank you guys for the support and the love, um, man. So I'm gonna keep grinding. This is not a setback. This just means um, that door was closed for today. Tomorrow may be another door. Monday may be another door. All these doors start closing. I'm gonna find some windows, bitches. You know. <laughs> but um, other than that. Um, I did shave, so that's good. You know, at least I, I'm clean again. <laughs> um, I'm still taking my medicine. I'm going to sit down uh, and clean out my car and um, get on the road, man. I got I to gotta go make some money. And tomorrow is, is football day, so I want to make some money today. I've been practicing some, some dealing stuff, as you saw, that I was uh, going through some procedures. Uh, it wasn't great, so don't really judge me, but know that I am practicing and I am grinding. Uh, much love. Hit you guys back up later. Peace. I'm the, I'm the, I'm the.